Yeah. Yeah. We, we missed the shuttle. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Young yes, and free. Thank you. We got married at yeah. 17. So long ago, back when the rainbows were black and white. Thank you, Laura and Chris. This is so much fun. We're so happy to be joining you for this amazing event. Thank you for being a wonderful reason to bring us all together. I love you guys, and I better have really good music because that's what I'm looking for, dancing. Thank you. <laughs> for Chris, you better take good care of Mara. She's a winner. You're a lucky man. All right, be good. Any woman but the woman who is going to change his life. love for family without bounds, and most important of all, your wisdom in finding more to share your life. Since the day you walked in her door, you have belonged. So let's cheer for it. Dad is definitely here in spirit. Without a doubt, I know that. Maura, he loves you. Out of doubt, I know. Do you love Chris? Maura, I love you. I'm so happy you found true love in Chris. And I can't wait for you guys to grow your own family. I just want to say, I love you guys so much. And I'm so happy for the love that you I love you to death. Um, some would say, like a brother, and I would argue sometimes more than my own. I think there is one phrase that best encapsulates who Chris is and how he lives at his life. That phrase is live, laugh, friends, family, and loved ones to the wedding of Chris and Maura. I want you two to take a moment to look out at the crowd, to look at the faces of those you've gathered to witness this day. This is your team. These are your people. 
Allow yourself to celebrate how wonderful it is that for one day, you have brought together so many of your beloved family and friends. You are intentional about your words, your actions, and how you design your life. This intentionality can sometimes border on OCD, <laughs> but it means that you truly live your priorities and don't lose sight of what's most important in life. I promise to always make space for us to have new experiences and be playful, even when life gets busy. I promise to love you even when we're two worn out people sitting back in our rocking chairs, holding hands and chuckling about all the amazing times we've had. I promise I'll never tire of you. I'm yours forever. I know I took some convincing, but standing here right now, I feel so thankful to share these vows with you in front of our closest family and friends. My hesitation, that was quick. <laughs> My hesitation wasn't because I didn't want to do this. It was because I was afraid I wouldn't be able to find the right words to capture the depth of my feelings for you. All right, little break. <laughs> <laughs> You're the open arms I've hoped for my entire life, and I promise no matter what, I will always come home to you. I love you. <laughs> now comes the part we've all been waiting for. By the power vested in me by the state of California, I now pronounce Chris and Mora husband and wife. You may kiss the bone. <laughs> lifetime of happiness and joy and I know you'll be there forever for each other and it's just wonderful to celebrate you guys today. Wow. Such a happy day. We love you. We love Laura you. and Chris, congratulations. I wish you a lifetime of happiness. I'm so happy you guys found true love. You are really perfect for each other. I can this is just the beginning and I can't wait to see where the journey goes next and to share more memories with you guys as you grow your family. Love you guys. We love you so much. Mom says she's not going to say anything, but we can tell she's holding something. Yeah, yes. she wants to say something. Because you're the perfect couple. Yes. Well, there you go. I mean, that's that's all you get. But we love you so much. We love you so much. It's a gorgeous ceremony. We We're so happy to be here and, and part of your family and our extended family. Yeah. Well, thank you. <laughs> They decided to spend Christmas with us. So I agonized quite a bit over, you know, what gift do I give my son's girlfriend, who I'd really like to be my daughter-in-law, uh, to make her feel warm and welcome and truly part of our family. So after a lot of thought, I decided to give her COVID. <laughs> Rivers flow to the sea, to the sea, to the open arms of the sea. Lonely rivers cry. Yeah, 
wait for me, wait for me. I'll be coming home, wait for me. Look around. You are literally surrounded by loved ones, and we're not just here for a good party. Although, wait, we're totally down for that. <laughs> but we're here to support you in your relationship through thick and thin. Now, let us raise a toast. <laughs> to the groom, to the bride, we have our hands on your backs as you stand side by side. Cheers. <laughs> So when we were first thinking about what we wanted to do, we thought it could be fun to do a slideshow of Chris's former ex-girlfriends. <laughs> uh, a, a ghost, you know, girlfriends of the past. Uh, but we thought that was cheesy and stupid. And, uh, and feeling like I was in your shadow, but in hindsight and looking back, uh, it's pretty incredible that anyone would ever compare me to you. Uh, so it, you mean the world. I think uh, our dad said it best earlier, which is you really took on the role of older brother, you know, without hesitation, and, and you took it on with a full heart, which, you know, I made a lot of things, a lot of mistakes that you probably got blamed for, which I can <laughs> admit now. I got protected a little bit as the youngest. Um, Chris and Mo, we, we wish you the most incredible life of happiness. We're so lucky to be able to partake in it as well. Um, and let's get on the dance floor, because i got to take my shirt off.